Love plays a major role in my life right now. It's the reason we exist. The work is not pleasurable without love. It makes me happy to be able to have somebody that needs me. To find something to put a smile on that person that you, you love's face. Love is everything right now. You're alone sometimes. You fall into these crowds where you feel like you love, but at the end of the day, when you lock in behind them bars, you can't call them people. It's hard to trust. It's hard to trust. I felt like I didn't know how to love no more. I was just gonna be this cold person. I'm just gonna shut down. A lot of stuff happened to me I don't understand. And I realized reading the Bible that every battle's not mine. God plants seeds all the time with different people. You just gotta see it. Um, tell me about your girlfriend. My girlfriend, um, met her incarcerated. <laughs> uh, she's an amazing woman. I mean, most jail romances never <laughs> pan out, so uh, ours kind of did. I fall in love with who somebody is. I, I mean, I believe love, it, it surpasses gender and everything else. It really does, you know? Me and my husband, we've been together three years. In June, we'll be married for one year. And I love this man. When I got out of prison, we met. And it's crazy, because we met through social media. So we talked all day, every day. We ended up, you know, meeting up, and we used to go out, eat. Just all the different things that I didn't do with the men in the past, me and this man have done. He came from a broken past, and my past was broken, and together, we just bond really good. We've had a lot of the same trauma. We get things about each other that nobody else is ever gonna get. Now I have somebody strong at home that loves me unconditionally, and that's there, you know, rubbing my back like, it's okay, you can cry, baby. You know, I don't feel so alone in this world knowing that somebody else under, understands it the way that, that she does. The longest I stayed home is when I had my baby. You know. And I went to the penitentiary at a young age. So I gave my mother and her father's mother joint custody. So sometimes you can love somebody from a distance. I have a uh, two beautiful little girls, uh, 11 and nine year old. My, my parents have my kids. It was a better option for them, for stability wise. But they're both they're both amazing, wonderful, and good. They are uh, the reason why I'm still here. They've taught me love. I don't know that I knew love before. He has a daughter, she's 10 years old. That's like my best friend. We was riding, she said, can I ask you a question? I'm like, yeah. If I decide that I wanna start calling you mom, can I? I was like, sure, but I just want you to know, you don't have to do that. She was like, okay, well, I'll call my mom, mom, and I'm gonna call you mommy, you know? So now it's mommy everything. Before them, I lived like there wasn't a tomorrow. Now, I want tomorrow. We have sort of a unique setup on the SHE team that our relationships are really built on a shared experience of mutual respect, affection, and love. When I go and visit a participant on whatever block, it's understood that I am there for their benefit. The respect part is to understand that all people are human beings and deserve a measure of kindness. And then we trust their judgment and we trust that they know exactly what they're doing in their lives. Those are the people that can't be judgmental and they're there to listen. There is something almost kind of magical about Joy's approach. I feel like I'm called to this work. It just became second nature, like immediately. 
something about Joy. I love her. I love her to death. You can call her for anything, you know, and if she don't have an answer, she'll get that answer for you. I was able to talk to her and just, you know, being alone, and sometimes I didn't always feel so alone. We have one of the longest going cohorts of health studies with women leaving the criminal legal system across three cities because of those relationships. I can't get rid of her. I don't care where I'm at. Just join find me. <laughs> she find me. And I love it. I, I love it when, I, when she calls and I'm in a good place. But you know what? Even when I've been in a bad place, she never hangs up. I'm glad he put her in my life. The team in my life.